Whoa, that's so cool. Hello. Hi. Are you the guy that built the house on Upper Hillsborough? Yeah, I'm Aaron Stafford. I'm an architect here in Charlottetown. I'm Dylan from Next TV. Nice um, to meet you. Nice to meet you too. So I'm here to learn about what you do on a daily basis. Yeah? You want to understand a little bit about what an architect does? Not that I could do it, but I could understand it. Maybe we can start. I've got some sketches here. We do a lot with uh, computer Is kind that of your animation. House? That was our house in the, in the beginning. You completely designed this on your own, like this. Yeah, it start, we started from scratch. Um, so, you know, we sat down and said, okay, what do we want in this house? Mm -hmm. um, and part of this was we, this house is aiming to be the first LEED certified house in PEI, mm -hmm. which is an environmental um, rating. Mm -hmm. So it looks at how much land are you using, how much water are you using. So mm -hmm. all of those things kind of start to influence what you design and draw. Mm -hmm. This is the model of the house as it kind of got a little more developed. Did you do this too? Yep. That's so cool. Yeah, so, you know, we use a, a little bit of everything. We use kind of hand drawings, mm -hmm. we use the computers, and, and we use physical models as a way to kind of explore and test ideas. Mm -hmm. This is Google SketchUp. Okay. It's a free program. Uh -huh. So I think if anybody has an interest in this, it's you can download it, mm -hmm. and it's pretty intuitive to use. I yeah. played Sims, and I was good at that. Yeah, well, so maybe similar, similar to that. Yeah, look at oh, that. Oh, cool. Could I build my own house? Like. If I wasn't even an architect? I think 2% of all homes in North America use an architect. It's a very small number. Oh, really? Um, and I think because people perceive it as expensive to do, mm -hmm. but in the end... It my, would be saving... You would save money. Mm -hmm. You would have a better quality house that See, would... See, I didn't know that. That would this sell faster. Yeah, so this hire a professional. Guy. Hire a professional. <laughs> all right, all so right. let's go check out your actual house. Okay. We had talked about the fact that the house is aiming to be LEED certified. The wood siding, for instance, is mm -hmm. all local black spruce siding. Is it like different what? than normal vinyl siding? Right? Yes, and very different than vinyl siding. Mm -hmm. um, the wood siding being that it's a natural material. Mm -hmm. um, local being that it's not being shipped across the country and mm -hmm. all the fossil fuels being burned to transport it. Um, mm -hmm. One other feature I guess we could talk about is rainwater collection. Okay. So when it rains, it uh, it falls down into the rain, this tub. This is all still in construction, so mm -hmm. it's not finished yet. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, we have an 800 gallon water tank, and so we can use it to water the lawn, and wash the car. So you're reusing it all? So we're reusing it all, yeah. Yeah. Leads. So maybe we could go into the house and okay. we'll show you a little bit of the inside. So this is it? Yeah. So how do you design the kitchen? Oh, what's the point of the windows being so low? Well, when that is landscaped and there's a fence there, instead of looking into the eyes of your neighbor, it's about looking down and seeing the ground and seeing flowers and seeing plants. So it makes it seem more private. Yeah, more private, but still brings daylight in. I can't believe you've come up with all this. Yeah. Like... One of the other, I guess, kind of green features or things that we tried to do is, is the staircase here. Sherry Lee, my significant other, mm -hmm. her grandmother's property had an elm tree on it that had Dutch elm disease. And so we took it and cut it down and had all the wood dried and then cut into the stair treads. That's so cool. So on top of those being local and you know all those things, it, it's, also, has it also has sentimental value. Pretty. When you sit down, nobody can really see you up here. Mm -hmm. And it's, uh, it's nice and quiet, and on a summer day, it's uh, nice and shady and keeps you cool up here, so. So I have a question. Yeah? I was wondering if you're interested in sewing. Well, make me an offer. I got 50 bucks out in the van. <laughs> <laughs> what well, do you think? <laughs> we, we might have to negotiate a little bit on that. It could that, be a down payment. We might be able bucks. to work something. <laughs> All right, thank All right. you so much for showing me Thanks around. a lot.